Yeah? Yep. Uh, well, Graham, uh, nil nil draw, still unbeaten, still to concede. How satisfied are you tonight? Um, it's a tough one, really. It's a tough one. When a team goes down to 10 men, you would like to go and win it. Um, but even with 11 v 11, um, I, I, I was really, really pleased with what the lads done. The chances we created in the first 20 minutes, again, we've started fast. So, uh, look at it. I, I suppose I have to be really proud of them. I have to be really pleased with them. Again, it's a, as you quite rightly really said, it's a clean sheet. Had somebody offered me that uh, the start of the game, I would have taken it. So uh, I guess I guess I have to uh, I have to be pleased, yeah. Considering the way you're talking, certain situations can often present themselves in games. You played half an hour with a man extra. You've been really greedy. Did you want three points with that advantage? Yes. Yeah. And did you do enough? Do you think to, to get that? Um, probably not. Probably not. Um, I don't think we. We asked what was it, 11 shots, uh, three blocks. So just looking at the stats, I'm not sure we asked enough questions. We walked their goalie enough. We get into the right areas, we put balls in, but I have to give credit to Mansfield. They put their bodies on the line, they blocked, they cleared, they kicked, they tackled. So credit Mansfield. Um, you know, it's not easy playing against 10 men, um, but um, we, we just, uh, we, we've come a long way. We've been in, uh, the club has been in some dark places over the last couple of weeks, couple of months. So, um, it's nice. It's nice that the dressing room with a smile on the face. It's nice that the dressing room feel uh, feel that that the hard work has been uh, has been somewhat rewarded with a couple of clean sheets. But uh, I suppose look, we, we, we would take two points per game. We would take uh, we would take four points after two games. Yes, all day long, and two clean sheets. You've only been at the job for five days. It feels like a lot longer already. Uh, what have you made of the response of the players in general across those five days? I've just said to them in there, I'm really, really pleased with them, really pleased not only with the players that are on the pitch, the players that are off the pitch, and it's really difficult at this moment of time for referee players to actually make an impression or to force their way into the team because uh, I, I don't see much of them in training because we, we, because we play Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, we hardly train, so I'm, I'm, I can't wait to go um, full week with them, can we full week? But the response from anybody, not just the players, but the, the staff, and again, I don't know what the numbers were there tonight, but it was certainly noisy. Yeah, they, they, we must have had 200 fans there but, uh, to come all the way to Mansfield. And the environment that we live in is, uh, is unbelievable support as well. And I think the players feed off that. Um, and there is a bit of a spirit there. There is a bit, uh, a bit of a spirit there for everybody to, uh, to grab a hold of and run with. And how pleased are you with uh, the, the defensive organisation of the show? Because before you came in, they only kept one clean sheet all season. As I mentioned in my first question, you've yet to concede so far in two games. Well, it's the commentator's course, so uh, I'm not going to get too excited. Um, we've, we've we've done a little bit of work. We've done some shape. We've done some set pieces. We've done some some patterns of play. So it, again, it's crawl, walk, and then run. So the them lads are giving us uh, giving us a little bit of a base to walk off. I would have liked us, and I will like us, and I will want us to play quicker, to play sharper, to move that ball quicker. And those moments, in those moments, I like that quality and, 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 and have to take uh, to take the uh, take the ball and so maybe go and win, win games. Yeah. But look, I have to be pleased, and I'm, I'm really proud of them to be honest, yeah, because they've they've been in, they've had a tough time, they've been in dark places as well, and they've come out fighting for me uh, yet again. So uh, I'm really pleased with them, really pleased with them. And I, I, I tell you what, you've got a really good, decent bunch of boys in there who are, who are honest and hard working. They really care. They they care. Them lads, I can only imagine what they were going through over the last couple of weeks, couple of months. Um, they, they they were uh, they were hurt. They were certainly hurt. So um, please, really please, um, build the blocks. Let's let's push on. Let's try and, uh, and build on those four points that we picked up and the two clean sheets. Yeah, you said small steps. It'll be another tough one. No, no, big step on on Saturday against another good side. Well, like I say, uh, Mansfield will be there or thereabouts at the end of the season. So will Northampton, we know that. So they're, they're good tests. Um, they're not ideal uh, for, uh, for a manager who's only uh, in five, six days. But look, they're good tests. And the one thing that uh, after, after the, uh, the, these type of games, you realise what you've got. You realise who's in there and, and, and who's in the fight, who's in the battle with you and who's fighting the battle for the football club. And I tell you, every one of them, not just the 18, I keep, uh, I keep mentioning the, the, the periphery players. about these guys to correct and to fix what uh, what, what has gone on in the past. Yes, sir, great, thank you. Brilliant, thank you very much. Is that, is that the, the time constraints? Does that mean you've not had, have you concentrated more on defensive than 
attacking at the minute through the second team? Um, or? If, if I'm being honest, um, I, I, I don't want to be stand here and, and, and tell you lies. I haven't really, I, I haven't really, I've, I've organised them a little bit, I've talked to them a little bit, put them in bits and pieces, but we haven't done much, um, to be honest. I've, I've just maybe tried to take the shackles off them, i just tried to relax them a little bit, i just tried to give them that bit of confidence, that bit of self belief, because they're a good, good bunch of boys and, and they, uh, they, they're. they're I was going to whistle down the road. 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 So, confidently attacking side of things will come uh, with that, especially maybe next week when you've got a, a full week well, to work on a few things. Rome wasn't built in a day, yeah. so uh, let's, let's, let's take uh, incremental, incremental change, incremental steps, uh, bit by bit. Uh, as I say, crawl, walk, and then run. So, uh, Look, we'll, uh, we, we, we'll improve, but no doubt we'll improve. How far we go, I don't know, but uh, it's, it's, it's one of those. Let's, let's walk, let's get the training, there. let's do some walk, and then uh, we'll uh, take it from there. There's one man, I mean, you mentioned the players who are outside the 18. Aaron Lewis has been a, well, been a regular for Flynn, Patswell, and, and Robery, he's, he's on the outside, which is well, a slight surprise. What's, what's the sort of thinking behind? Well, again, like I say, I've not had uh, the, the, the lads. It's difficult for the lads who are not in the team um, because they don't actually get too many training days or too many occasions to get in front of the manager and, and, to, uh, and to, to show what he can do. I didn't change the team tonight because I, didn't, I, I want to give the players continuity uh, and that's where the confidence grow. Consistency, continuity, and that's how the confidence grows. So that's what I was after tonight with the same 11. Um, so it is difficult for the lads that are on the periphery. But like I said, that have been there. They're the ones that are pushing. They're the ones that are the, the most important players the club um, because they're pushing the ones that are in the team they'll keep them as have a standard anybody in, uh, in the change room who comes off it who, 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 who uh, slackens off or, or, or things to be made in clean sheets four points anybody who will come down on them they'll step aside and somebody will come in and take the jersey but give them the jersey I don't want the jersey I can keep them on the jersey don't go back to them your eyes are going in I can see you on the jersey <laughs> 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 I just want to go to the kids no, no they crack on you'll be sick of me